We have new jewelry ideas in metal and in wood. We have bangles, we have necklaces, we have charms. There's a lot to work with. There's a lot to work with, and what woman doesn't like jewelry? <laughs> so let's get started. Come play with us. None designs are known for really quality metal uh, mm -hmm. findings, yeah. yeah. And these are her brand new charms that are actually double-sided. They are, so you can kind of see that this has got a design on one side mm -hmm. and a different design on so the other. So these are actually the same charm, different sides. Right, but you get two in a package, mm -hmm. so that works out well That's to nice. show. So same thing there, she's got rectangles, circles. And, and then some flat charms. Yes, with nothing on them, and mm -hmm. that's good to know for a reason I'll show you in a minute. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and some tiny squares. Here's the back side, there's the front side, or vice versa. Right, and then there's a connector, which does some interesting Ooh, things. That so, really cute. shall uh, we step back in time for a minute and just re show you a project? Because this was shown on a webisode using the bubble caps. Yes, the Shape Studio. Right, and, and it's like the tiniest circle we have. Yeah, it's a half inch. Mm -hmm. So this has gone, do you want to pull that uh, yeah. connector out just so we can see what it looks like separately? Um, here it is. And, and it has a little crown on there, right. which is really cute. Which is very cute. Um, so you can use it that way and you can use this bottom one to connect all kinds mm -hmm. of other things. And what was done here is the big oval, small square, rectangle, some stamping on it. Mm -hmm. And that was actually done with um, stays on, so it, it stays right. on the middle. <laughs> on. <laughs> and wanted to bring in the plain tags because that's what this one is stamped yes. on too. And this is kind of a variety pack. I don't know if you can, there it is, right. the little circle there. And um, the I think this is from Artful Collection. I think it is too. Because they've got some tiny words and images. Right, so you can do a collection like that. We have a simplified version mm -hmm. right there. <laughs> and this one is actually does not have anything in the center of it. And this is actually on a card, but this card could double up as a gift. Exactly. So just tucking in some extra ribbon and a note. Like so. Like so. <laughs> and let this be put on with zots or mm -hmm. foam tape, something that's going to be removable. You can create that not only as a card charm, but as a necklace. Right, I think it's a really nice mm -hmm. idea, and just so that you know, we always show you the inside of our Very card. Very cute. Now, another thing that you can do with these charms, I mean, there's just lots of things, <laughs> yeah. is uh, to use the Ranger memory glass mm -hmm. with the memory frame. I think this is just, darling. That this, is charming. This is the one inch, and it's got the new Mixum heart. Yeah, and this is, this tiny guy is one of our jewel dazzles. That's or actually, no, she's, she's actually used this from the Mixum Heart sheet, oh, okay. one of the innies. Okay. I can tell because of the glitter in there. Okay. So sparkly. But I like the square with the circle. Mm -hmm. And then if you wanted to, you could certainly bring in, oh, a rectangle also and mm -hmm. maybe make a little grouping at the bottom. So, and these come, as you saw in the packages, there are many of them, you know, two right. or more in this, the package. The tiny ones have three and the others have two. Okay. Mm -hmm. So there's just a lot of mixing and matching. I also think, and we haven't done it, mm -hmm. but I got to thinking last night that the Petite Dazzles, Ooh. now they're gold and silver, but you can tap these with the stays on yeah. and change the color and they're so tiny. And that place them on those charms and then you'll have kind of a dimensional embellishment Exactly, into any color you want. Mm -hmm. So I think there's just a lot. Now you could color in, can you color with the Spectrum pens? You can color them in and um, you can also color, for example, the crown green oh. and then the background pink. Oh, okay. And that would be a cute way to actually decorate that. So there's stuff. Yes, okay. there's stuff. <laughs> now, speaking of stuff, we have some of the wood bracelets. These are yes. the bangle bracelets. And uh, some new ideas for this. We've got, these are two of the um, example projects we've got. And those are shiny, do you yes, like them? Yes, they are shiny. <laughs> That's what I said when I first saw them. Um, these are actually uh, designer adhesive, and that comes from Clear Snap. It does. And it's covered with some foil. Right. So, shall so, I show yes, you how to do that? Yes, please do. Okay, so I might as well show you the package. Right. Um, the adhesives are there. 
and there are four designs that we have mm -hmm. right now, and there are multiple sheets in here. There's four sheets. Four in sheets. Each. Okay. Mm -hmm. And they're longer than what this design shows. Right. They, they, they fill the, fill the package. <laughs> and then here are the foils. And these come with six sheets each, so, so that's nice. So, just to go back, so um, obviously there's the pink mm -hmm. and there's the green, and um, those were using the adhesive. Now, when so. I saw these packages together, I had no idea that they could make this. I was just kind of like, why would you buy foil <laughs> in a strip? How do okay. you use this? So, so all of I'm those here questions. To show you. Okay, tell us, enlighten us. Okay, so here's a blank bagel. Ba bagel. Bagel. <laughs> bagel. A plain bagel. I'm hungry. You're always okay. hungry. <laughs> a blank bangle. Okay, <laughs> got that. So, so this is actually the design adhesive, and I'm carefully peeling off. So you're peeling the liner away from the design. The design's yes. in the adhesive. The design is on that kind of clear sheet. Oh, it's on the clear sheet. Okay. It's. I don't know why I was thinking it was like a Zod. It would be over here. <laughs> okay. Just very careful. Now you've trimmed this down yes. to fit the uh, bagel. Bangle. <laughs> now you're doing, oh no. Okay. Can you hold the bangle for I me? I can. <laughs> and I'm going to just line it up here. Okay. And Lene says, says, start on one end and wrap around. Okay. So I'm going to wrap that around carefully. Carefully. All right. So let's rub that down real nice and hard. Just with your fingers. You don't need mm -hmm. to do it with a stylus or a bone mm -hmm. folder or anything? In this, um, I mean, you could if you really wanted to. Okay. But it isn't necessary. <laughs> we'll find out. We'll find out. <laughs> <laughs> and? It's always an adventure on the webisodes. Okay. Okay. So. Okay. I was right. <laughs> As I breathe this out. I like, felt you holding your uh, breath. <laughs> so this is actually on the plain ah, wood itself. The okay. other bangles <laughs> have uh, been painted with right. smooch and such like that. Mm -hmm. So Lene gave me this tip. So there's this um, adhesive on here that you can see. This is sticky stuff. Mm -hmm. And the foil, and your first instinct is to go like this right. and turn it over right. onto the adhesive, but no. Don't do that. Don't do that because you want the blue part to be showing. You don't Which want it upside sense. down. Or read the directions first. Yes. That could help. Or but, watch the mm -hmm. webisode. But who reads directions anyway? <laughs> so here we go. Okay. I'm placing it on here ah. all around the adhesive design. Okay. And rub that down really well. Same method as Same before. Same method, yeah. Same thumb I'm method. Yeah, I'm actually seeing some. Are you? Design. Can you almost feel it? Maybe if I roll it. Ah. Okay. So get that stuck down really well onto the adhesive. And then. And then when you peel back. Ta da! Look at that. Look at that. Very pretty. Very pretty. So there's your okay. blingy brace bangle. 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 Bracelet. <laughs> <laughs> and then you would seal it. Yes. Okay. Yes, definitely seal it. And she also said if there are places on here, like if you close up on some of these areas, they haven't been all kind of filled in with the with the foil. Maybe as much you as can you can go back and oh. press down really hard and it should kind of fill that in. Oh, that's nice. So yeah. you've got that option. Mm -hmm. Okay, so just looking at some choices here, we've got three different finishes, three different colors. Yeah. And um, look at this foil sheet. You could use that for something too. Absolutely. It's actually got pretty shapes on it. Now, you would uh, seal it with. Um, uh, Either diamond glaze or crystal lacquer, right. just like a thin coat. Yeah, because mm -hmm. when it's worn, you don't want anything yeah, to rub off. Yeah, you want it to be you know, waterproof, yeah, too. Yeah, you do. Now, another idea occurred to us, and those of you familiar with the uh, Zentangle, mm -hmm. um, here's one of the books, and Lene took this and matched it up with the butterflies and dragonflies uh -huh. template. And it looks like a mosaic, doesn't it? It does. It looks like a very tiny, intricate mosaic. And she just picked different patterns out of the book. Mm -hmm. She used, um, as I said, the 15 butterflies and dragonflies template. 
and mm -hmm. she used the design right here. Now, a really simple way to get this design on the bracelet mm -hmm. would be to do it on a strip of paper that you measured out. Oh, and you then, could. And then just paste it on there and then glaze over it. Okay, so Lene, in this case, and we'll get in really tight mm -hmm. so you can see it even more, is that she actually uh, used that micron. Yeah, the precision micron pen. Right. She used that straight onto the, the wood. Mm -hmm. And then she said that when she tried to do seal over it, it kind of um, smeared a little bit. A little bit. So what she used was this spray um, acrylic sealer, which okay. you can find in the... Um, spray paint section of any store. Okay, and then then she went back and then she colored it with what? Um, alcohol pens. The Spectrum, the Spectrum Noir pens? Noir pens. Okay, yes. so it just looks so detailed. Mm -hmm. I really and like it. And then another coat of sealant was put on, on the top. top. Now Susan tells me this is very relaxing to do. So <laughs> yeah. very fun. And this is fun too on the oh. edges. Great. Just a little design. So just really wanted to share with you mm -hmm. more jewelry ideas because, as we said, you just can't have enough. Not enough sparkly things either. <laughs>